it's the characters are about to be locked. I thought that was me seeing it. The characters are locked in. The stage is set. Nest and Villager. Another matchup I have never seen before, but I am happy to learn. Although I do know like some things about each of these characters. It's definitely going to be a question of whether or not Shaman is able to find his way in versus that slingshot the Villager has. We're already seeing these buttons in full force. I feel like uh, Ness is one of the characters that would have a little bit of an easier time getting in, just because he's like smaller in yep. terms of his uh, hurt for box. Sure. For sure, that uh, that uh, landing slingshot might not always find its mark, but so far, uh, Shaman's doing a pretty good job of finding his way in. And Ember's uh, playing it real slow, you know, just keeping his distance, trying to oh, very nice grab there. Gonna get, a, gonna get a look for him there, but unfortunately not gonna get much out of it. Shaman's able to get a good nice reversal there. I mean, I can't really blame Ember for playing as low, because most oh, of the time, Shaman has been like winning these up-close interactions. Mm -hmm. sure. You definitely, not many people can contest Ness's button, so you're just going to have to hold your distance. Yeah. Focus on with punishing, oh, that grab's not going to find his mark. I'm him. No, you're not dead. I, he almost died. I, I'm not happy. Oh! <laughs> Okay, I think I know what I'm going to be watching for the next 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Alright, uh, despite that uh, unfortunate end of that first stop, Shaman's still in a pretty decent spot. Can eat some... Uh... That was, was the weirdest combo long... I've ever seen. I was wondering how long that was going to go. <laughs> <laughs> Thought we were seeing a little bit of a pseudo-infinite right there. Gonna find that in there. See if we can find this kill throughout the ledge. Ooh. Slingshot messing up Shaman's plans for a ledge guard right there. Another near. Ooh, very nice, um, very nice use of a uh, pocket there to kind of stall himself. Yeah, I mean, if you have very that nice. good of a recovery, you can really just yes. afford to do that. Absolutely. That was a very nice drag down up air to, I believe, up tilt by um, Shaman. Yeah. So it's not all too bad. Able to get a PK fire, unable to get much out of that conversion though. And, um, Ember's, uh, he's going for a lot of grabs. And I know the villager character, and across characters kind of don't have the best grabs, so it's actually kind of interesting to see. But, uh, Shaman doesn't appear to be punishing these grab attempts too badly. Maybe he's unable to, maybe I'm strong, you know, so gonna find that PK fire, though. Going to him up there. How's he still keep, how's he gonna juggle him? Ooh. Very nice parry, though. I don't even know if that should have parried, because, uh... That came out on the opposite side that Ness was on. It's probably like the initial hitbox that like drags you up, and then the rest of it on the chain. Maybe. Regardless, though, Shaman is uh in in the driver's seat to take the. So uh, I did not say anything. <laughs> that up there will take it. <laughs> we have <laughs> the even... car crash. <laughs> car crash. <laughs> that was an accident. <laughs> We got even stocks once again for this third game. So this is a little bit of a back and forth right here. Both players are uh, playing it uh, decently well. And takes that uh, PK fire away, kind of unfortunate. Another PK fire. Ooh, doesn't matter. <laughs> Ness has a lot of buttons, oh my god. <laughs> Just oh, a nice lot nice of aerials. Player. Yeah, yeah, there's that, there's that, there's that, there's that punch trying to go for that robber. Act. It's a bit too and impatient at the ledge, Ember. He's able to get out of that just fine. Looking pretty bad though, he can't get grabbed like that again. So yeah, one back throw at this point. Yeah, he's gonna, have to, he's gonna have to play this real careful. That up air might do it, that up air will do it. Good stuff to game, Shaman in that game one. Very, very, very solid stuff. Kinda, both his stocks lost were, uh, Kind of funny, in all honesty, but uh, <laughs> he was able to keep his composure, and we'll see what kind of uh, counter player adjustments Ember's gonna make for that second game. We're gonna wonder if he's gonna play, try to play an even slower game too, and we're gonna see banjo kazooie music. So I hope whoever picked that loses. <laughs> Sorry to say. <laughs> so just gonna uh, leave that out there. Is that what's going on? What's going on here? Are we gonna see another? Here. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what's going on there? <laughs> what's going on? This is the Wii Fit region, by the way, if you didn't know. We have too many of them. Please help us. Alright, let's top right. And then the second game here, I believe we went to Battlefield. A new stage. I always love to see. Not PS2. Very true. Uh. And, uh, 
nice seven piece combo right there. Gonna get that conversion off the grab. Nice slingshot there to cover the platform. Ember is coming out firing on this so far. Just doesn't get that bowling ball, but regardless, what a good start to this stock. Hashtag not find his mark. Second attack, knocks on find his mark. That grapple also not find his mark. That narrow will go. Another slingshot. Very nice. Are we going to see the pocket on the uppie? No. <laughs> it does not matter. <laughs> no very, very nice stuff. Remember, they're just able to play a cool, calm, collective. Just took away all of Shaman's options. Just finished it up. Very nice stuff. So far, this second game, it is looking like a much different, much different set from what we saw in game one. The match they kind of surprised. Ember was playing it a bit more up-tempo, which is definitely something you can do, especially against a character that presses buttons like Ness. Right now, uh, it's, it's Ember's turn to... Uh. All right, okay. I, I'm gonna forget. I didn't see that. So. Uh, <laughs> I pretend game, I do not. Second see game. Second game. Ness Villager. Two stocks. Smash four. Let's get it. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Someone has been threatened, and uh, <laughs> uh, we don't play around here, man. This is a house of God. <laughs> Very nice pair for that slingshot, and that slingshot might take a smart. Unable to get that jab jab block. Though. Ooh, magnet into grab. All right. Damon kind of just chasing down Ember there. That's very good stuff to him. I feel you gotta be able to chase Villager if you want to be able to beat him consistently. I mean, yeah, because if you don't, you're just gonna be eating <laughs> all of those forwarders and back airs. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you heard it here first. If uh, that player loses game one, he is going cloud. Live, in action. And the right classic counterpick. <laughs> and right now, Ember's uh, definitely playing it a bit more defensive. Does not want to interact with Ness anymore. He's at that percent where a lot of things will just kill him off touch. He's getting a lot of that bowling ball. Yeah, I mean, I can't really see the stock count right now. It's 2-2. But... Uh, two, two. Oh, we can't see the stock! <laughs> that's, really fucking, that's really funny, that's pretty funny. He's gonna find that narrow shield. Yeah, Ember's doing a really good job of keeping himself safe when he's trying to recover. <laughs> oh, wow. okay. All right, that yo-yo is. That Lord Rocket is very strong, but that yo-yo is very weak. Look at this tree. I mean, strong Shoot. enough to take out that Lloyd. Yeah, literally. <laughs> he's gonna find another one. Of... He's gonna find another PK Fire off uh, the platform. Ember is just running into that one spot where PK Fire will hit him every time. Okay, pocketing oh. the PK fire, not getting That's anything off of it though. Very nice slingshot there, come on, and that bowling ball will take care of it. Very nice thing, very nice remember there. I think I'm starting to get a uh, Y Ember counterpick to Battlefield. Why he went to Battlefield? Yes. Um, I'm not too sure honestly. Like I'm not really sure like these characters' advantages, weaknesses on stages, but I feel that Ember probably wanted the platforms as like a place to land, perhaps. Probably. You don't really want to land on land on or near Ness too many times, but he's definitely getting struggling in the aspect of like every time uh, Shaman's PK firing on the platform, he's always getting hit by it. So I don't, yeah, like that. <laughs> just like that. He's just, I don't know <laughs> if he's like sure like the threat range that has or where he needs to position so he can avoid that. But regardless, and right now he's just doing his best to try to stay away from him right now. He does not want to get hit with another one of Ness's like that. <laughs> that's gonna hit with PK fire. And Shaman's gonna let him recover. Not much can do when he gets recovery there. Once again, another PK far off platform. Okay, weird F smash coming out there. He wants to end it. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's hungry. Regardless, though, it's gonna it's look it's looking a little dire for Ember here. What's he gonna what's he gonna have up air? Gonna find that forward air for the stock. Off stage, roll, nothing. Very nice grab there. Grab coming out. Very nice slingshot. Yeah, you and Diamond wants to get them on stage now, but ooh, ooh. the yo-yo going right through those balloons. And Shaman with the 2-0. Good stuff. Good stuff to both players, but very nice set there. It's the weird double-sidedness to a uh, villager up because like you can hit the balloons and yeah, that'll solid. like extend uh, hitboxes. Yeah. But you also get, just get like so much range for that up Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's definitely like a double-edged sword there, and I think Shaman just kind of realized, oh, he's I know where he's going to be, so. Might as well. 